What have we here? It's clearly an e-bike, suspended with the rear motor working. It's uh, working at 13.2 miles an hour, 13.1 miles an hour, and it looks like the throttle is taped in such a way that it's on cruise control. And I'll tell you why, and that's because I want the battery, which is right here, this down tube, and it can be removed and charged off of the vehicle or on the vehicle. I want the battery to last as long as possible. And if sometimes that means running the voltage down from its fully charged state, which is normally about uh, 54 point something, uh, down to like 48 volts, and you can see right now it's already at 53, and that's after about 20 minutes of running just like it is now. Uh, but it was fully charged. I will not be able to ride it for the next maybe four or five days. And it's not good to leave the battery fully charged. So I'm running it down. And when I'm ready to ride it again, I will charge it up. And because of the chemicals involved in this process, it's better to do that than to leave it fully charged during these four or five days. Uh, the battery will last longer. So yeah, that's why we got round and round.